I think that's just a part of growing up too. It to the beach with my friend today out in North Shore. So it's gonna be a little bit of a drive away, but I'm so excited. I haven't been to the beach in so long and I don't know if you guys can see, but my tan lines are so bad. So I need to get a little bit tan today. So I'm just wearing this really cute strapless bikini. I love the yellow color and I love the pattern. And then of course the matching bottoms, but I'm just wearing jeans over it for now. And then I'm also wearing this really cute tote bag that I actually got last weekend from the Made in Hawaii festival. It's so, so cute. This material is actually vintage. So all of the materials that they make their bags out of is from like the 60s, 70s and 80s. So I literally love the pink color. It is so, so cute. So I'm gonna use it as my beach bag today. So yeah, that is the little beach fit for today. So excited. <laughs> stopped at Wicked Hawaii Cafe before we go to the beach. We got a... What pizza is this again? Honey goat cheese. Honey goat cheese. So it has like goat cheese on it. And then they also have like the crust dip. So we both got the Caesar crust dip. And we're sitting in this cute little like area that they have like separate from the cafe. So cute. Oh! <laughs> guys i hope you all have been having a lovely september so far i am actually about to head out in about an hour or so because i'm gonna take myself on a little friday night date night today i think since this month has started i have been kind of finding a new peace when it comes to doing things on my own and being very independent i actually used to do things by myself all the time when i was going to school away in la um, for college before i transferred back home but ever since i got home i obviously do a lot of stuff with my family which obviously nothing wrong with that i absolutely love doing stuff with my family and spending time with them but i think ever since i came home i actually really haven't had a lot of time to myself to like do stuff so i actually think this month i've really been falling in love with my own independence again and just doing things on my own and it's actually really refreshing so yeah i actually am gonna start off today with redoing my nails and then after my appointment i'm actually gonna head straight to a restaurant to do to try some of their happy hour menu i'm gonna probably have like a drink and then maybe something small to eat and then 
it's Friday the 13th, obviously, so I wanted to do something like Friday the 13th themed and I'm gonna go and watch Beetlejuice Beetlejuice by myself. So yeah, I'm actually really excited, although I have never vlogged, well, I've vlogged in public before, but I don't think I've ever vlogged in public by myself. Usually I'm with my mom, my sister, or like my friends when I'm vlogging, especially I haven't vlogged in a restaurant by myself, so I'm a little bit nervous, but you know what? It's fine. I'm never going to see these people again, so I don't think anyone cares. <laughs> This is tonight's look for the little solo date night. I am so excited. I am wearing something a little bit more casual because obviously I'm gonna go to the movies after happy hour. And then also because I'm seeing Beetlejuice, Beetlejuice, it's been kind of like a trend for people watching the movie to wear like black and white striped things or black or white. So I wanted to keep with the theme and just wear black. And then obviously it's fall now. So I wanted to wear a little black sweater, but yeah. And then I also layered a few of my necklaces today and yeah that is the finished look and I am gonna head off to my nail appointment now We are hiking Makapu'u this morning. I'm with Ivy. It's me again. <laughs> Guys, okay, so her husband is doing like military training right now. He's gonna be away for three months. Yeah. So I am her new husband. You guys are gonna be seeing a lot of her this month <laughs> because we're gonna do a lot of stuff together. to the top! Yay! <laughs> A little bit later in the day I am getting ready to go out and get Korean barbecue with Kylie I am literally so excited you guys I haven't had Korean barbecue in so long I think it's been like I think the last time I've had it was like February or March of this year so I literally am so excited to eat I can't wait 
I am starving. I actually haven't eaten since I went on the hike with Ivy. So uh, yeah, and it's like an all you can eat Korean barbecue place. So I'm super stoked. I also just realized that I didn't debrief with you guys about my little solo date night last night. And let me tell you guys, I actually had so much fun. Like I honestly didn't expect to have as much fun as I did. I've never been to a restaurant by myself before, like just to eat by myself. So you guys know, like I was a little bit nervous and especially because I was vlogging too. People were definitely looking at me filming, but I don't, pe I don't think people really cared that I was eating alone. I mean, as expected because literally nobody cares. And growing up, I actually always thought it was so embarrassing to do things by yourself, whether it be going to the movies, going shopping by yourself, eating by yourself in restaurants. And it's actually not embarrassing at all. Like so many people do it. People are literally just like living their lives, trying to get by. If you're hungry and you're by yourself and you just want to go grab happy hour really quick then by all means i do it like literally nobody cares and i think that's what i've realized as i've gotten older and i'm actually so happy that i've realized that because i feel like hanging out with myself is actually so peaceful and like very therapeutic in a way and it also gives you like a new sense of independence so i definitely encourage all of you to hang out by yourself once in a while i feel like it's something that needs to be done every once in a while of course it's always fun like hanging out with your friends and hanging out with your family all the time but i feel like everybody needs like their time and their space for themselves and yeah and i think that's just a part of growing up too it's just like being able to like do things on your own as well so yeah i think i actually like really want to do those solo dates more often because it was actually so much fun like i really had such a good time this is the finished look for tonight to go and eat Korean barbecue. I am wearing this white crop top from Zara. It has like this mesh detailing up here. And then I am wearing it with this mini skirt that I got from Brandy about two weeks ago. And then it was a little bit big in the back. So I actually decided to use this necktie as a belt. I actually got it from Free People. So yeah, so, so cute. It adds a little bit of color because of like the blue in it. And yeah, that is the little fit for tonight. Happy Friday. I came to a coffee shop today to get some work done and study. I came to this really beautiful coffee shop in Hawaii Kai called Island Brew Coffee House. I absolutely love the vibes here. It's so peaceful and calming to just sit outside and do your work and it's so aesthetic. So I got a few things. So I got a turkey pesto sandwich for lunch and then I also got one of their fall special drinks which is the pumpkin patch matcha. It has like pumpkin cold foam, pumpkin and matcha. So I'm super excited excited to try this and then I also got one of their homemade brownies okay let's try their pumpkin patch matcha I've never tried anything like this before mm. it's pretty 
good. It has like a little bit of spice to it from the pumpkin. I'm not usually a huge fan of pumpkin, but this one isn't like too much of an overload. So this is actually pretty good. This is the outfit for tonight's date night with Ivy. I am so, so excited. I literally got ready in record time, you guys. I am so proud of myself because I don't think I've ever gotten ready that fast before because our reservation is at six and it is currently 5.40 right now, so I actually have to leave. But yeah, I am so, so excited. We are eating Mexican food tonight and then we're gonna watch the fireworks. So I'm so excited. Ivy's here, you guys, she made it, okay. <laughs> she walked to the wrong restaurant because when we were talking about what restaurant we were gonna eat at, we were talking about two different places, but we were planning for two different days. So she thought I meant a different restaurant and she walked to that restaurant and then she called me and I wasn't at that one. So she walked all the way here, but she's here now, you guys. She got here. Made it. <laughs> and we got her drinks. I got a lychee strawberry margarita. Yeah. Strawberry Jamaica. Okay, cheers! It's Friday! It's Friday, <laughs> finally! Yes! <laughs> Gonna try the table side walk. Mm. Good. The amount of walk we have to chips though, like the ratio is very off, but the walk is really good. Sip it in the consomme. Super good. But it's very juicy. It has a lot of flavor. Oh my god, this is so close. That's so crazy. <laughs> This is today's outfit for the party. I, of course, wanted to be a little bit more dressed up, but not too dressy. But I also kind of wanted to go for comfort today as well. So I'm actually wearing this really cute long romper. And it's basically like this checkered brown and white pattern. Of course, in honor of the first day of fall, I have to dress in fall colors. So yeah, that is what I'm wearing today. And I am so, so excited to see my family and my nephew.
I was able to come back home for about an hour and a half so I could get ready to go bowling with my friends but the party was so so much fun I always love spending time with and seeing my family so that was really nice and Jarek my nephew is literally the cutest little three-year-old so it was really nice being able to see him and celebrate him but now I'm headed out to go bowling with my friends so I am wearing this top from Japan so I don't really remember what the name of the store is but I'm pretty sure it was like from one of the boutiques there and then I paired it with my brown necklaces and of course going with the brown theme because today is the first day of fall again and then I paired it with my light wash baggy jeans because usually in bowling alleys it's very cold so of course I'm not gonna be wearing like a skirt or anything like that but still wanted to kind of keep it cute and comfy and casual so yeah this is the bowling fit for tonight I suck at bowling so please be warned you guys Thank <laughs> you.